Hi guys. So today I want to show you a really amazing special place. Right now I'm here outside taking a walk, which is what I try to do every day whenever possible. If you know, during the day, you need to have an energy booster, something like that. You know, you're losing motivation in whatever you're doing, you need some inspiration. Then there's one special place where you can go, no matter where you are. Whether you're here in Constance, whether you are somewhere else in this world, you can go to such a place. And I'm going to show you this particular place right now. And if you feel like you're welcome to join me, in this beautiful day. Let's go. So here I am, this is the magical place I was talking about. As you can see, I was talking about a graveyard. Now guys, please, before you jump to any conclusions about the state of my mental health or <laughs> whatever else, please hear me out. See. If I didn't know that you guys are most likely if you watch this video you're interested in maybe in yoga or in spirituality in general or just about you know growth if I didn't know that you would be interested in that I wouldn't tell you this if I would speak to any other person um, I wouldn't tell them that I come regularly to visit the graveyard because they might think um, you know, is he all right? <laughs> why I come here and why I feel it's such a powerful place to be at. Because for me, I learned, you know, that reminding myself of the fact that I'm going to die is really like one of the strongest motivators and incentives for me in my life it sounds like a little bit sad you know constantly reminding that you're going to die but the fact is if you're gonna try this you'll actually realize that it's not so much sad as it's actually really opening up another door you become much more life oriented you become much more aware of the value of life you start to value life and small things in life that you've been taking granted. You start valuing them so much more and appreciating them. And for me, it's like such an inspiration, a motivator. This is not something that I have come up with. This is a tool basically, which has been there in the yogic tradition for thousands of years. The yogis already thousands of years ago, they went to them you know, in India to the places where they would burn the dead bodies and they would spend time there at these places because it's such a reminder and that's why I come here also because it's one thing, you know, to try to remind yourself of this um, fact that you're going to die and it's very effective and I would recommend you to do it if you have not yet but it's another, it's a completely different story if you come to a place like this. And you know, you walk 
among the dead people. It's almost like you are among them. And that is like such a more powerful reminder than just thinking about it or intellectualizing it. That's why for me, it's one of the most powerful places that I, you know, can go. So I really like, you know, would urge you to try this. If you think right now, okay, he went a little crazy, it's okay. But before you stay with that initial judgment, at least, you know, give it a shot. Try it out for yourself. You know, the good thing is like a graveyard, you can find it anywhere. Just go there, try it out, just sit there for some time. You know, read the tombstones actually, you know. Read the names of the people who died there, you know. Read the dates, when they have died, and just imagine. So this woman, you know, she lived from 1906 till 1997. So this woman was fortunate enough to have lived for 91 years. How fortunate is that, you know? How special is that? Very few people have the privilege to live that long. Some others, they might live only for 40 years. There are people who have lived only for 30 years. They might have died in war or sometime else. You know, these people, they probably didn't expect that they would um, live only such a short life. They might have had plans to do stuff in their life which they weren't able to do. And, you know, for me, I try to make this a reminder that whatever I think, you know, yeah, that I get 80, 90 years old, maybe, but you know, you can't take it for granted. So better not like put things off too much, you know, live your life. I'm trying to live my life as, you know, I don't know how much more time I have, you know, even if I only have a couple more years, I should be happy then to be able to leave because I lived like, I don't have to look back, you know, with regret. I think that would be the worst thing if you have to look back on your life with regret because you didn't live like, you know, like you would have if you actually would have realized that it's so short. So that's one of the like key things for me that I try to always live up to. To live in such a way that even if I have to go earlier than expected, I can still go with dignity and without any regret. You know, even if you struggle to walk on a dream that you have and it seems like you're not achieving it, I think it's better and you will be able to leave with more, you know, um, fulfillment knowing that at least you have tried it, at least you have tried to live your dream, you know, you work towards it. I think that's more fulfilling than if you would have, you know, you went the safe way, you know, you didn't try it, you, you, so you didn't fail, but you also didn't try it and you don't know what would have happened if you did. So the point is, you know, just go to the space and see what it does to you. Maybe for you it's completely different, you know? Um, what things you might realize is different. Everybody in life has different priorities. But the thing is, at least you become aware of this fundamental fact and I'm sure it's gonna benefit you in some way. So guys, I hope you like this maybe unusual video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and um, leave a comment below if you would like me to do something else talk about something completely different you know i'm trying to explore different topics so i would love to hear from you what you would be interested you know and because the point of this video is to make it interesting for you so please let me know what you would like me to talk about where you would like me to go and to take you and above all, guys, please make sure you subscribe to the channel so that you get all new videos and we can stay in touch. Guys, thanks a lot for watching and see you soon.